super well hello if you are new my name is Lauren and I do all sorts of videos on here especially baby related at the minute and sort of vlogs and stuff like that because obviously I'm expecting a little boy very very soon um so if you like what you see please make sure that you hit that subscribe button and like this because video. we have this little thing youtubers and it shows half of you guys that watch me are actually not subscribed so please make sure you subscribe to the channel because it means a lot. Um, but today I'm going to bring just an updated baby haul on what stuff I've bought recently. Stuff that I have bought. Um, I haven't done one for a while and obviously I'm buying and buying and buying and buying which is super exciting. And I love all these baby bits that I'm buying. I just love it and I can't, I can't stop. Put it that way. Um, so let's just jump straight into it. I'm just going to go just random through everything, guys, that I have bought. So recently I got this off of eBay. Um, this is a baby caddy and basically it's just this grey caddy. I'm going to get another one, but you just store your nappies, your diapers, you know, little bits in here that you need for baby. And I'm going to keep this next to the bedside. So at night when I'm changing him and stuff like that, the wipes are there, the nappies are there, you know the nappy rash cream or whatever's just there and it's I've got it and I'm also going to keep one in the living room because it's going to be so much easier to have something like this than to where's the changing bag I need a nappy I need a wipe it's going to be so much easier to just grab this have baby take it where I need to go and change his bum and stuff like that um so I bought this off of eBay I will try and link everything down below that I got because it was all quite recent so I think I'll still have the links for everything um, but I don't think this was very expensive. It's about eight pound. So, and I've just got to go and get another one. So I love that. And there was loads of different colours that you could pick from, but obviously I went for grey. Um, and then also here I have got some baby wraps. Um, are they baby wraps? I'm gonna be swaddling. There you go. I got it eventually. Baby brain is real. Um, so these are just little baby swaddles. I washed them and I tumble dried them. And they seem to have shrunk. They've got very small, so hopefully they fit him. Um, I need to get an air dryer thing where I wash his stuff and I just leave it to dry um, naturally on the dryer because I've found that I've washed a lot of this baby stuff and I've used a tumble dryer and it's made everything very small. And we don't want that. Um, but yeah, I just got these off of eBay. They are just literally baby swaddles with a bit of Velcro here. So I got that tree design. Um, this blue and black dot one which is so cute and this one here is just black and white with little crosses on and obviously baby's legs go into here and then you swaddle them up and wrap them all up so they feel cozy and secure they feel like they're in the womb um, and then I got this one as well I love this one this is a cloud one this is a bit better quality than these ones here that I've got um, and it's a little bit thicker and uh, quite a bit bigger I think this is naught to three months why it's that bit bigger but yeah i got this one as well i definitely want to swaddle baby just because i never did it with ollie and apparently it helps with sleeping and just making them feel safe and nice and i would like to try something a little bit different this time so i have bought quite a few baby clothes and my sister really kindly bought me loads of bits for him um so i can't really remember everything that i got him and she got him so I'm just going to show you what he's got basically so far. Um, this cute little hat and mittens. This cute little hat and mittens were actually from a charity shop. Now, how stinking cute are these? Um, I've mentioned before, I love a charity shop. And if the product's fine and it's washable, there's absolutely nothing wrong with using it. So there's a little grey mittens and this little hat. And I freaking love it. It's so cute. Um, this is uh, zero to six months. So... It's just so cute. I had to get it. And it was like a couple of quid from the charity shop. And it's like new. Blankets. I think I've showed you guys these blankets already that I've got for him. Mittens. Or oh, I think my sister got them. I'm not too sure. Just to stop him from scratching his face. Little baby socks, which I love. It's a Primark for me. And picked up loads and loads of nice baby bits. So 
some little vests here so we've got some loads of different designs i love them she's very my my sort of style my older sister so i always get worried when people buy baby clothes i did with ollie just because i'm very plain and simple and I, I, I'm that person that can't tell some. I can't tell you if I don't like it. I'll just be like, I love it. Thank you so much. Uh, with her, like, you just can't go wrong. Like, we've just got the same style and she knows what I like, which is good. Grows and vests and stuff like that. Um, this that I bought from an outlet. This is, um, it's a cool choice. It's basically a next outlet. And I love this. And it was £3. How cute. But I didn't realise, guys, what it said on it. It says... Born in 2020, and he's going to be born in 2021. Well, unless he comes early, but I hope he doesn't, because he'd just be too early. But yeah, he'd have to wear a little coat with this, wouldn't he? And I said to my mum, I can't put him in that. She goes, yes, you can, it's fine. It, I won't, you can't really hardly see it. But yeah, it says born in 2020, but for £3, I picked it up anyway. Um, Loads of burp cloths, so these are just like muslins here. These were all from Primark, because I got loads of them we're gonna need loads of them and some just some cute little baby bibs here as well um more little cute socks how cute are they the socks are adorable but they never stay on newborns do they just they just never do oh i got them ones from aldi and then i also picked up these plain white ones off of ebay and it's just got a little cloud on it and it says hello so i got a pack of them off of ebay and i love the fact as well the hands here it's basically a built-in mitten so you just turn it over like that i love the fact I, that's really sleek and tidy for me i love that stop them from scratching their face so you haven't got to run and get some mittens and it's already on there i love 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 that i also want to get some of these with the zips because they're just so much easier at night than the buttons so, and I know next do some really, really good ones with zips as well, because Ollie had a few of them. But I've just got all of these clothes at the minute in one of these boxes here. Um, just keeping everything, trying to keep everything organised. Obviously, I'm in Ollie's room at the minute, and this side of the room, luckily he's got quite a big room, but this side of the room is all of the, where I keep the baby stuff at the minute. Um, also, I don't know if I've addressed it, but... I've dyed my hair. I'm now brown again. When don't I? I'm always changing my hair, but yeah, I'm, I'm brown now, guys. Um, also, again, from the charity shop. I love it. Is this baby snowsuit? How cute is this? I love, love, love this. Can you guys see it? And it was £2. It was £2. It's like new. It's originally from Next, and this is six to nine months. And how nice is that? Again, go wrong with the charity shop also got this off ebay here it's hard to sort of see what it looks like but the legs are here baby goes in here the head's here and this bit's here this i believe is zero to six months um but it's like a buggy snowsuit so obviously i'm having him and it's really cold over here in the uk and he sort of does need a snowsuit in the pram to keep him warm so i bought something like this off of ebay i just need to get a smaller size it's so fleecy and thick and warm and look at the little the little tail can we just that's so cute so i got one of these off of ebay not very expensive guys at all and then also i needed obviously you guys know that i kindly got given my buggy but i needed to get quite a few things for it um so i bought the car seat the isofix base i had to buy the carry cart the adapters the bag and stuff like that but i've managed to get it all i've got a brand new car seat rain cover for the car seat obviously which is good again just ebay um i also the lady that gave me the buggy gave me this as well this just clips on to the handlebar bit and your hands just go inside so when you're pushing baby your hands will stay nice and warm which is a really good idea but i don't know if i would be using that personally um but it's nice to have then <laughs> i'm so excited about this bit um this is second hand because there's nothing wrong with second hand stuff but i got the black silver cross changing bag that i'm very excited to use and will go with my push chair i was debating to get the silver cross one that matches 
or just another one that I like the look of but I'm so like you know OCD and stuff and I just like everything to match and look nice so I went for the matching bag with the matching buggy so and I have put a few things into the baby bag but this will probably change I have ordered little man's coming home outfit I'll see if I can pop a picture on the screen just here I haven't received it yet obviously it's Christmas time and delivery is kind of a nightmare and I'm getting impatient because I just want it now because I really want to see what it looks like how cute are these nappies I went to the hospital the other day to get my whooping cough jab and the lady goes um to all of us it's the midwife she's like guys i need this box i'm gonna just give you some free bounty packs i think they're called like baby packs um and i got four little pampers in there and they are so tiny and cute obviously i'm gonna use them so i popped them into my baby bag also in the little pack we got some baby vitamin d drops i remember using these on ollie you can use them as soon as they're born um you could just drop it on your finger and let them suck it off your finger or you drop it on, put it, can put it onto your nipple if you're breastfeeding or onto the dummy, whatever way you prefer to do it. And then how cute is that? Little mini pseudocreme. That is just so cute. So that came in the pack as well. And then loads of little leaflets and money off of things. I've got my dummies, my dummies, his dummies in the bag. Um, I've also put like some stuff oh this is one of them as well this is again another um baby wrap as well a swaddle which i really like this is a gray one that i've just popped into the um baby bag but like i said i've just popped some cute bits in at the minute and just i'm excited okay but it's probably all gonna change like look how cute that little starry gray sleep suit is i've popped that in there i've popped a Grey little vest in there with some little dogs on it. How cute. Um, what else is in here? Some more baby vests. Um, plain white sleep suits with some elephants on. Hard because I don't know how big he's going to be. And I thought, I don't know if anyone else struggles with how, what to buy, what size to buy. Do you go off from the baby that you've had before? Like how big they were? Ollie was 7'3", so he's a really good size. But that was still really small and everything we bought he was still really tiny for so i do get worried about like how big he's going to be and if the stuff that i've got is going to fit because it'd be kind of annoying if it didn't um also in the bag i've put my little pump thing this is basically when i'm breastfeeding him the other boob tends to leak um i breastfed ollie so i i, saw, I know this one will leak and the milk just goes everywhere and it's such a waste like it's liquid gold at the end of the day and this here is i can't remember the pacific name i'll see if i can pop it on the screen um but i got this off of ebay this is just a little lid it comes with and you just squeeze it like that and then you pop your nipple into there and then you let go and it will suck on to your boob so while you're feeding him on this side it will catch all of that milk and you can store that and freeze that with the baby freezing bag things what are they called the milk bags that you put in the freezer i'm not very good with terms and stuff am i um but yeah no it's just brilliant way to catch that milk and just not let it go on a cloth and get wasted so i thought i would get one of them um and i've just put it in the, the bag i thought why not put it in there and a lot of mums i've been watching a lot of videos and a lot of mums recommended these so so much so i picked one up um, also I've got in there, I probably don't need this in there, but I'm going to put it in there anyway. This is a Tommy Tip, Tommy Tipper little kit here. So you've got your hairbrush, the toothbrush, the nail clippers, the comb, the little nose squeezy thing when they've got boogers, a filer, cutter and a thermometer. This is the Tommy Tipper grooming kit, that's the one. Obviously I probably don't even need that in there, but if he's got long hair I might need to brush it. So and instead of just putting the brush in the bag. I just put the whole thing in the bag because the bag is quite big, which is really, really good. Obviously, I've also put things like muslins in there, mittens, little baby socks here, um, little bibs. And also, I got these the other day as well. How nice is that little hat that I ordered off of eBay? It's just this really nice plain white hat. And then these really cute ones as well. I believe these are from Primark. I put them in the bag but like I said guys I will do an updated um 
bag, hospital bag, and my hospital bag and his hospital bag towards when the time is to have him because it will probably all change. Um, and then also, this is a personalised dummy clip. How gorgeous is that? Obviously, I can't really show you the whole thing yet properly. It has got his name on it. I'm super excited to use it. It's absolutely, just look at the detail in that. It's freaking beautiful. Um, and this is the lady off of eBay that makes these. And that's just in front of the change bag. Um, obviously, I can't really show you too much because it's got his name on it. Um, but yes, it's super, super cute. So guys, I have just woken up. Um, but before I went and had a nap, I edited the video and I forgot to show these bits that I got last week in Aldi. And I love, so I'm just going to add these bits in. Pregnancy. I needed pregnancy. I needed a nap today. <laughs> How cute is this from Aldi? This is uh, for tummy time. I really love the colour and the style of this. This was $7.99, $8.99 I believe. But this is great for tummy time. And I've not seen a pillow this nice. Like a little round pillow for tummy time. I've not seen one as nice as this. And it's so cheap as well. So I had to pick that up. And then also I picked up this here, comforter. So I'm going to pack this um, for little man. And hopefully this will be sort of his first little blanket and toy that he loves. Um, it's got little tags on it. It's super, super soft. And it wasn't very expensive either. Again, it was like, I think it was about five, six pounds, something like that. Um, but I know Ollie was obsessed with labels and like filling them and sucking his dummy and like going to sleep to labels so he might be the same we don't know um but yeah i thought i had to pick that up because it's just it's so cute um but i just wanted to show you them bits guys um because i forgot to add them in um but yeah anything else that i've put in here i'm trying to think i think that's all i've got in there at the minute obviously then it probably needs to be more in there and i'm probably missing stuff so if i am let me know guys um, but that's what's in there at the minute. And I probably will wash and freshen everything back up as well, because that's just what I'll do. Also, with the carry cart, I really, really needed the, it's called like the foot muff or something like that. And I needed it for the carry cart and also the bigger seat when he goes into the bigger seat. But this just clips on to the carry cart off the buggy. So I got that off of eBay. This was £25. Um... And I'm glad because now I've got that bit and I've got everything that... Oh, I haven't got everything that I need. I got this bit the other day. I also need the car seat adapters. Because this silly dumbass here ordered these off eBay for 20 odd quid. And they fit the bro they fit the buggy, but they don't fit the car seat. These are actually for a maxi cosy car seat. So I've got the wrong ones. So I went back onto eBay and ordered the right ones and yeah now i'm still waiting for them and then i have got everything for the buggy but i don't know they clip into the buggy frame but not the car seat why don't they just do these all to go in the buggy frame and into the car seat why are they all got to be different like this it just makes us it just makes it harder for us mums right anyone agree so now i need to try and sell these because i don't need them um but yeah i think that's everything that i've got so far i'm sort of super still waiting for a few bits to come as well i hope you guys find this interesting it's just some bits that i've bought for him and this is stuff for me to look back on and what i've bought and stuff but yes i'm super excited i am 29 weeks and five days pregnant which is crazy to say out loud it's absolutely mad i will be doing an updated um an updated pregnancy video soon because the symptoms have changed quite a bit and when don't they they change every week let's be real right um but yeah that's what i've got so far so i've pretty much nearly got everything i just need a few more baby items like a few more clothes uh you know quite a lot more clothes and I need a play mat and also I want a really nice swinging chair. I've seen this one I like, I can't remember the name of it. And it moves all on its own and stuff like that. And it plays white noise and it vibrates and stuff. So I've seen stuff that I want, but 
We're doing well. We're doing well. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. But yeah, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please like it. It means so, so much. Leave a nice comment down below and make sure that you're subscribed. Because like I said, half of you have not even subscribed. You've just got to push that red button to help me out. Please. <laughs> That's so cringy. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I will see you all soon in a brand new video.